And welcome back, this is Bala Scoop with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3. I'm joined, as always, by my faithful squad of Abel, Novin, Bloon, and Sackman. When we last left off, we reached the end of the dungeon. There's there's nowhere else for us to go. There's also battles as soon as I take one step. So that without anywhere for us to go, let's go left to a secret passage where we find two, four treasure chests, two sets of two. Four. And we find Reflect Mail, but it's a trap! It's a trap! Against... I don't know what the hell that is. That is a... It's a Death Claw! Let's kill it! I'm gonna assume it's weak. It's green, so let's shoot lightning at it. That is surely the best way to go. Oh, Novin comes in with Shadow Flare, so instantly max damage. And down it goes! I'll, I'll show you guys the next one, because I don't think that really shows how hard that fight really is. 680 kill, 1875 experience. Really, this is this is a great place to get experience. Not so much kill, though. Not so much the kill. So we got another Reflect Mail, and in here we find the Triton Hammer, but it's a trap! Oh no! Oh, we've got a new enemy, so we won't really get to see the other one. This one's an Eater! He eats! Damn him! Damn him to hell and his eating! I don't know. I got nothing. He's got no eyes. Thousand damage! <laughs> Noman comes in with Whirlpool! Is this gonna finish him off too? No, okay. So now we actually get to see how much HP it really takes to finish this guy off! Go advance! Almost 4,000 damage thanks to those sword upgrades. The swords are definitely kicking ass for Abel. We get 945 kill, but a ton of experience. Almost no experience. 255 experience. What the hell? What the hell, game? At least we got the Triton Hammer. Over here we get another Aegis sh Shield. I don't know why I struggled with that one, but it's a trap! Of course it's a trap. Do we have another new one? It is another new one. This is a dragon thingy. It's a zombie dragon, of course. Because dragons can be zombified. No, screw it. Go, Aroga! Just regular attack. It's been a while since we've seen Aroga. And <laughs> Novin comes in with Shadow Flare. Once again, is this going to be a one hit a quitter? Max damage is enough for the win. Down it goes. Novin is just taking everyone's thunder today. 2,880 gil, 3,750 experience. We're just raking in everything. All right, this last one. Is this going to be another tough battle? We do get a trident for our trouble, but it's another trap. This one's up against a real dragon. A live dragon. This is a periton. No, they don't even call it a dragon, even though it's the first one we've come across. Once again, I'm going to go for Aeroga. Because it's flying, and then... Of course, the spears will do massive amounts of damage all by themselves. Go, Ice Pillar! 3,300. And, yeah, he might do max damage all by himself. 9864. Nine, nine, Apparently, me leveling up for Odin has overpowered me for everything else. We get 2,400 gil, 2,400 experience. But I swear, this is, this is usually when I go for it. Okay, let's take a look at all this equipment that we've gotten. Ancient sword, but yeah, everything's down. Uh, nothing new there. Uh, reflect mail is down. Diamond gloves, there we go. There's, there's an upgrade. Nothing there. No. Yeah, just that stuff. Listen, yeah, looks like that's gonna do it for what I can do right now. No trident. That's right. A trident. 108. Holy crap. <laughs> Let's get that on. Oh man, he's got an attack level of 192. And, ah. Uh, what does he have? 153. Good lord. But that actually is it for this dungeon. So, I'm gonna teleport out of here and I'll meet you at our next destination, which actually is further along in the plot for some odd reason. We're gonna try to keep that going forward. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. And I am at our next destination. This is Cape Twinhorn, which is where Doga told us to go. You can see easily why they call it Cape Twinhorn. Let's go ahead and try to go inside now. I have healed and saved once again. 
because I know this place can be quite tough. So let's head into the Temple of Time, which just happens to be right here where we were told this place. I remember doing a lot of level grinding to, to reach this place before. The door is locked. But you never thought we'd have to use magic keys again. I know I didn't. Let's go ahead and use that, though. Hopefully there's some good treasure in here. There is not. There is. Way over here. What do we got? A diamond helm, which I already had. If you make me go back and get more, more magic keys, I will be very upset with you, game. I will be very upset indeed. This place is huge. Oh, I'm gonna need to go get more magic keys. What kind of enemies do we have here, though? We do have... Deeras. Okay. Let's use lightning on them, because I don't know what else to use. They're multicolored. Advance. 2600. Once Sackman comes in, though, because he does have those spears, and spears are always useful against flying enemies, he should definitely finish the job all by himself, but maybe he doesn't need to. Down it goes. And for that battle, we get 610 gil, 820 experience, and a job level up. Nice. Oh, and a full level up for Sackman. Always good. Always good. But, yeah. Is that my last magic key? It is. This is not going to be worth it. If I need to get more. That will, that will anger me greatly. We get diamond bracers! Once again, I think we already have these. But let's just double check. Diamond gloves, right. Uh, diamond bracers. There we go. Diamond bracers. Power bracers! Yes, of course. Okay, we are done with the braces. Let's move on then. Keep going left, or not. Or not. <laughs> we'll have to go south here, it looks like. And down through these stairs, and then we can head up across the water, up to the other side. I bet there's a few new enemies in here, but we're not going to see them this time. And up these stairs, we can find stairs leading down. Sweet. So you go upstairs to go downstairs. It co makes complete sense. But, oh, I bet there's something to the right here. Yes, there is. And then here we, oh, we get the Defender. Now, those of you that follow Final Fantasy, you know that how awesome the Defender is. Yeah, cast Protect, attack level 95. Ah. Uh, so yes, Cast Protect, inflicts Paralysis, that's why it's called the Defender, Cast Protect, but it's going to be my strongest weapon, so I'm keeping it on for now. <laughs> Let's go down these stairs, and, uh, do I have to go in the water? I don't like the water. Oh, you've got to be kidding me, I need another magic key. You again. Do I need another magic key for you? I do. I will teleport out of here, get a few more magic keys, and I'll be right back. Okay, I went back to Gasol, got myself 20 magic keys, because I don't want to have to do that again. So yes, you will need at least three keys before you get any of this stuff. I, th I think it's like five keys, actually. But just to make sure, I got 20. Ugh, I hate having to backtrack to get items that I haven't had to use to reorganize all this crap. Okay, we opened the, the lock, so if you don't have a thief with you, bring magic keys. Bring a ton of them. We get diamond mail out of the chest, which I don't think anybody else can use. You are worthless to me. Diamond mail, you cannot use it. You cannot use it. You could use it. Thank you! Somebody can use it! Thank you, Sackman. Thank you for using the diamond mail. It is very hard. From what I understand. Let's continue north. Uh, is there... Uh, are you gonna give me something new? You did give me something new! And now I'm scared. This is a behemoth! It looks like an ice behemoth. So I'm gonna try... No. There we go. Light rod! Hopefully that will do the trick. Go Whirlpool, though! 
Swarfle gonna knock it out? No, no it is not. 1663. Doesn't do nearly as much damage as when the guy's on the ground. 3400. Still not enough for the win. Go Light Rod! For 487 damage. Holy crap does he hit hard! Oh, when he gets two turns in because he's a dick like that. Let's go for advance again. This time we're gonna try fire. Go, 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 magic fire. 1200 still not enough for the wind. Is Whirlpool going to be enough to knock this guy out? No, because it keeps missing. Go, advance! 4800 still not enough for the wind. This guy is no put. Meteor! Oh, don't you do it. Oh, man. Go, go, fire rod. 464. Ah, oh, jeez, man. Let's go for a Kiraga on everybody. You attack. Ah, luckily Kiraga comes in first, so hopefully he doesn't cast Meteor again. What the hell? That's not cool. Events. Take him out. 2,989 is for the win. Thank God. Ah, I hate Behemoths with Meteor. We get 4,668 kills, 1,725 experience. It's getting more experience than the other one. Alright. Uh, hold on for one second. Okay, healed up. Everybody up to full health. Pretty much at all times we want to go for full health because this place is very, very scary. You find another locked door! So that's what, number four so far? Been locked doors in this dungeon? I hate locked doors. Just give me the damn treasure. I want to keep a thief in my party. I didn't start with a thief. What makes you think I'm going to get one now? We get diamond gloves over here and a battle right there with chimeras. Chimera mages. Oh, sorry. I wasn't specific enough. Holy crap. We got chimeras. Let's go for fire. New attack because they have wings, so I'm going to hope that they count as flying somehow. Go advance. Definitely enough for the win there. Ice Pillar. Go, go, Ice Pillar for the win. Down it goes. And then Sackman comes in. Is he going to finish this thing off? He is. Not nearly tough, as tough as I thought, but as far as I know, those guys can be very tough, so I'm lucky that I one shot them. 1,845 of Gil, 2,460 experience, job level up for Abel, level up for Nova, level up for Bloon, and nothing for Sackman. Sorry. Nothing for you. And over here we get a behemoth knife, which would be great if I had a thief. It'd probably be good if I had a thief, actually, considering all these locked doors in this place. But if we head over to the right, we find another locked door. Freaking locked doors, man. So, number five, bring at least five magic keys with you. Jeez, man. I bet this leads, like, further on in the dungeon. It does! This is the only way to get through this dungeon is either with a thief or magic keys. I hope you guys brought one or the other. And it, by the way, the thief does have to be in the front of your party. Is there anything on the side here? Is there a new enemy? Nope, these guys again. Over here we find nothing. Okay. So there's nothing here, maybe. More locked doors! Oh man. They are really trying to force me to bring a thief. I refuse to do it. I refuse. I don't know why. Never liked the thief, though. Never liked the thief. But on this left door, we get a diamond shield, which is awesome. And I head back down here, but not before we get into another fight with Bahamut? No, this is just a dragon. The hell? This is the Bahamut sprite. Go lightning. And then uh, Sakin should be able to finish him off. But holy crap, it's the Bahamut sprite. Bahamut sprite, even. Advance. No! Go, Spears! Spears will save my day. 
apparently they didn't. Go Light Rod! Finish him off! Don't let him get a turn in! Damn it! Ow. Ow. Damn you, Bahamut. Even though you are not Bahamut. Uh, let's go for a cure. Or not. And then hopefully this should be enough to finish him off this turn. The uh, Whirlpool damage would be nice. Because Whirlpool misses more often than it hits. Go, Spears! Spears of Destiny win! They win everything for me. And for that battle, we get 9,000 gil! Exactly 9,000, just for the record. 1,800 experience, a level up for Sackman, and that's it. <sighs> Freaking Bahamut clones all over the place. Let's go over to the right side. I bet this side will lead us further on in the dungeon, maybe. No, it leads us to a locked door! Oh, man. Is 20 not gonna do it? Is 20 not gonna do it? Because this is number 7. Number 7. What the hell? What is this? Noah's loot. The legendary loot sealed away with time. Within time begins a sound, a quiet song that reached deep within your heart. And we've got Noah's loot! Awesome! Now normally I would teleport the hell out of here, but there's still treasure for me to find. I missed some of it. Do you guys know where I missed it? I don't. So let's go back. Apparently we need to backtrack away because there is a little bit more treasure that I need to find. Oh, what the hell is that thing? That is a King Seahorse! Of course. Of course it is. Let's use lightning on it. And then you can attack the Chimera Mage, because you'll probably one-shot it. Go, Light Rod! Is this going to be enough to one-shot it? Down goes... Down goes the King Seahorse. The Ice Pillar comes in. And down goes the Mage. Yeah, this, this dungeon is not nearly as difficult as I remember. You get 1,295 gills, 1,720 experience, a job level up for Bloon. Now, the Chimera Mages in particular are going to be very tough if you're a few little under-leveled. I swore we could go behind this one. Is it up here? There, there, you can definitely go... There we go! You can go behind this one, and it leads to a secret passage that I forgot about earlier. We need to head down here, and here we can find some treasure. And this fight again, and this treasure that we have obtained after forgetting it is the Blood Lance, which is awesome, the Protect Ring, which is awesome, and the Lamia Harp. Will I equip these? You'll have to wait to find out next time because I've gone way over my limit. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.